Windows 8 comes with two web browsers and each bears the name Internet Explorer. One lives and works on Windows 8's start screen and the other calls the desktop home. Although they look completely different, the start screen's browser is really just a stripped down version of the desktop's browser. Because they're basically the same beast, the two versions share your browsing history, cookies, saved passwords, and temporary files. Deleting those items from one browser also deletes them from the other. The browsers differ in a few other ways but most obviously through the limitations of the Start Screen's browser. The Start Screen's browser shows sites only in full screen view. You can't place two sites side by side to compare them. To open Internet Explorer from the Start Screen and browse quickly, click its tile. The browser opens, filling the screen with your same home page you use on your desktop browser. When you want to visit someplace else, Fetch the browser's hidden menus with any of these commands. With a mouse, right-click a blank portion of the web page, away from any words or pictures. On a keyboard, press the Windows and Z keys together. And with a touchscreen, from the screen's top or bottom edge, slide your finger toward the screen's center. Here you will find a variety of items. Your last visited sites appear here, letting you revisit them with a click. Or you can close them by clicking here. Clicking this plus icon fetches a blank screen with an address bar along the bottom. Just type in the address of the website you'd like to visit. Clicking the Tab Tools icon brings a drop-down list with two options. New in Private tab, and Close Tabs. Select the New in Private tab option to open a new tab for visiting a website privately. The browser will conveniently forget you visited. The other menu option, Close Tabs, removes the thumbnails of all your previously viewed sites from along the browser's top. This arrow icon on the bottom left lets you revisit the page you just visited. Type in the address of a website you'd like to visit in this box. Or just type in a subject and your browser will search for it, displaying possible matches. Click inside the address bar to see a list of your frequently visited sites, as well as sites you've pinned to the start screen. Handy for viewing news sites, the refresh icon reloads the currently viewed page, gathering the latest material available. Take note of Pin to Start. When you find a website you like, Click this icon to add the page to your start screen as a tile. That gives you one-click access for a return visit. The Page Tools icon fetches a menu with two main options. Find on Page lets you search for text on the current page. View on Desktop lets you view that page on your desktop's Internet Explorer which is handy when the Start Screen's browser can't display something correctly. A third option, Get App for This Site, only appears when the site offers an app for direct access. Just as in the desktop browser, this icon lets you return to the page you just left. When you need more power than the Start Screen Simplified browser has to offer, Internet Explorer awaits on the Windows 8 desktop. To find it, Click the Start Screen's desktop tile. When the desktop appears, you find the Internet Explorer icon in the bottom left corner of your screen. The desktop version of Internet Explorer provides the same options as past versions. You can move from page to page by clicking links, typing an address in the address bar, 
or using navigation buttons. To set a home page, right click the home button. Add favorites with the favorites icon. And execute quick searches in the search box.